I went on a fishing trip uh, about four years ago and ever since then I decided that this was an organization I truly believed in. And from that point on I started organizing hunting events, started uh, acquiring sponsors and things from there just kind of snowballed and now we're here with a, a beer can with our logo on it and, and it's going extremely well. Freedom Fighter Outdoors is a nonprofit organization that is focused on returning the combat injured veterans back into more of a community than being singled out. Uh, a lot of times the veterans are spent a lot of time by themselves. They don't have somebody to associate with that guy knows what they go through. And so what Freedom Fighter Outdoors likes to do is we get these guys together and put them on a fishing event, a hunting event, a social event, uh, get them a good, good day just spending time together with people they can coordinate with and they, they can associate with and they, they're familiar with. So I found out about it while I was in the hospital through another wounded veteran who was a part of the organization and he got me out once I was home and in my house he got me out on a fishing trip and I just completely fell in love with the organization, met all the other veterans and it's just something I've been a part of ever since. Rusty Rail has uh, opened their hearts completely to us. They not only asked us to team up with them and do something that would be veteran related, they asked us what they could do for us. We didn't have to ask them a thing and ever since it started, it's just rolled from there. It's awesome, everything they do behind the scenes that people don't really get to see. It's very nice to pray, or pay tribute to them and show them how much people really care and how much they mean to a lot of people. Well, I think it's uh, a really great opportunity for us to, uh, to team up with uh, the Freedom Fighters and uh, for me it gives me a little bit of a chance to give back to, you know, to the people that are still serving or, or have served. We wanted to make a beer that everybody can enjoy. We wanted to make it very uh, repeatable, fresh, crisp and just something that you can sit down with your buddies and just talk and have a nice beer. It's amazing that people in the community can support the veterans. That's really the, the number one thing we ever ask for and the only thing that we ever really need is just support. You know, it's all we ask for from the community is to just support what we're trying to do because we're doing it for you guys and to see them doing it in a way that is really making a difference and no one is asking for it. They're, they're just doing it out of the kindness of supporting the veterans, it's, it, it's incredible. I'm thankful for our soldiers and uh, appreciate their work for us. Yeah, I was, uh, I was in the Air Force for uh, 20 years, um, retired about five years ago. Uh, I was uh, aircraft maintenance. Uh, I spent six years in the Marine Corps Reserves. Tango Yankee should be enjoyed by everybody, like freedom. They came to us and said, listen, we love what you're doing, we believe in it, we'd like to make this a more of a, a social experience. And so for today, the goal is get all these veterans here, just be together, have a good time, share some stories, laugh, enjoy a really good beer, and, and it's working extremely well as everybody's here just enjoying themselves completely.